This video describes the rules relating to government ownership of copyright materials, where works, recordings or films are made by or under the direction or control of the Commonwealth or State, then they are owned by the government. This is known as Crown Copyright. See sections 176 to 178 of the Copyright Act for the Crown Ownership Provisions. Works which are first published in Australia by or under the direction or control of the Commonwealth or State are also owned by the Crown. The phrase by or under the direction or control of is potentially much wider than the employer-employee relationship where government is concerned. However, in Copyright Agency Limited and New South Wales, Justice Emmett in the full federal court said that the phrase direction or control might not extend much beyond commission, employment and analogous situations. Copyright Agency Limited and New South Wales involved a number of copyright issues concerning survey plans. Under the Real Property Act and the Conveyancing Act in New South Wales, in order for title to be registered in land or for land to be bought or sold, a survey plan must be lodged and made publicly available in a register maintained by the government. Surveyors are frequently commissioned to produce survey plans, which are artistic works under the Copyright Act. One of the issues in the full federal court was who owned copyright in the survey plans. Cal argued it was the individual surveyors and New South Wales argued it was the Crown because the survey plans were created to satisfy statutory requirements and so the government had directed or controlled the making of the survey plans. The court held that there was no Crown copyright in the plans and that the copyright owners were the surveyors. The Crown did not bring about the making of the plans because even though the legislation and registration processes dictated the form that the plans must be in, it was still ultimately the decision of the surveyors and their clients whether or not to create and submit a plan. This case was later appealed to the High Court on questions of use and licensing, not ownership. The final point to note about Crown copyright is that it is now the Commonwealth Government's policy and the policy of many state governments, including Queensland, that all government material that does not have privacy, confidentiality or security concerns is automatically released to the public under a Creative Commons attribution licence. We will cover Creative Commons licences in more detail in a later video, but basically this particular licence allows anyone to use the content in any way whatsoever so long as attribution is given to the copyright owner. The rationale behind this government policy is that public sector information should be free to the public to access and use because it has been generated for the public benefit and because generally the public has already paid to enable the creation of that material via their taxes, so it would not be fair to make them pay again.